first things first, when you're about to set a trap, you need long sleeve, uh, long sleeve shirts, long pants on, nice thick pants, so um, yep, your, your scent doesn't, um, uh, isn't on the ground. You need your mat and your setter. Now I've got a reasonably large mat and I always put the mat down the same way every time. So the bottom's the bottom and the top's the top. So the first things first is you get a, uh, a small stick like this. Okay, so what I do is I put this small stick in the ground here and I'm going to have my lure directly behind it, directly above it and behind it. Okay, so I just got to remove a little bit of debris here. Now this stick here, that can act as a trip stick. So it'll be a good size trip stick, so I'll just put that to the side there. And I've just got to move this little bit of debris here so we can get the trap in the ground. Okay, next thing is I come out nearly two hand spans, one and a half to two hand spans. The trap's going in the ground there. This will be a single centre set. So you just move your debris all your mulch back out of the road, just rake it back out and rake it forward and rake it this way. So you've got to position your mat in a, about the right spot. So, okay. Next thing to do is open up the ground and you rake that in, rake it in to the centre. Bring all your dirt back onto your mat, keep your site, your site nice and tidy and clean. Okay, I've got my stick there to guide to the centre of where my centre of my trap's going in. Okay, the centre of the trap's going directly behind that stick, right in front of it. Right, I should be able to get my trap in there now. So the next thing I'll do is go and get my drag stick connected to the trap.